So the Federal Reserve just came out with some more information about how they plan to handle interest rates in 2019. And I think it has some interesting implications on the real estate market and its impact that it will have on home buyers, sellers, as well as homeowners. So late in 2018, the Federal Reserve announced that they would be raising interest rates a couple times in 2019. Uh, last year in 2018, they raised it four, t four different times. And so recently they've come out saying that there is a likely chance that they're not going to be raising interest rates at all this year, which is a stark new position and difference from uh, where they stood in 2018, uh, saying that they would raise interest rates multiple times in the year. And so I think this has some interesting implications on home buyers because, uh, um, you know, it means mortgages are going to be more affordable or going to continue to be more affordable. Um, and that will continue to increase home buyer demand if you're thinking about selling. Um, yeah, so for a home buyer, your mortgage is still going to be affordable. But for homeowners, there are, there is a potential chance to reduce your interest rate through refinancing if you haven't done so already. Um, some experts are beginning to predict and indicate that interest rates may start moving backward. Um, so if you're thinking about refinancing, I recommend you talk with a lender, of course, uh, or somebody at your bank. Uh, historically, you should be historically. It's been good advice that you need to be able to reduce and save on interest rate um, by two percent in order for it to be worth it. So do consider the pro and con to refinancing. So it'll be interesting to see in 2019 how the Federal Reserve uh, continues to handle interest rates. But every indication and information that's coming out from the Federal Reserve is that rates uh, rate hikes will be stalled, and they're going to take a more neutral position towards uh, the growth of the real estate market.